Use star code Aquila when buying Robux or Premium. Also check out my Roblox merch and my real life merch. These are all of my social media accounts and I have no backups. And my Discord server will be linked in the description. Subscribe and enjoy the video. Hi everyone, it's Aquila. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And it's back to school season. Comment down below and let me know if you started school yet. I know a few people did. But I hope everyone has an amazing school year. And a few months ago, I did a Build With Me Bloxburg series. I am planning on doing more of those. They just took a lot of time to film. And I built a school with you guys. It's a two-part series sort of thing. And if you missed it, it'll be linked in the eye in the corner. Make sure to go check it out. And because it's a new school year, I decided that I would upgrade the build. And I thought I would show you guys a full tour because this school build is probably going to be featured in an upcoming roleplay. And I wanted you guys to see the full thing before the roleplay. So without further ado, let's get started. The first thing I decided to add is a school bus. It's so cute. I made my own custom decal. There's a stop sign. And I did get this build from a tutorial and of course credits to the person who did this originally and i did upgrade it a little bit because that tutorial is a bit outdated so i know it's not the absolute best but i did try really hard and let's quickly just go inside i mean it's nothing too crazy you have the seat where the bus driver can drive and then of course the seats for the kids and I think my kids will be taking the school bus this year because they need to stop being so spoiled. And then I added this crosswalk right here so the kids can safely cross over to the school bus. Let's address this building. This is the Pastelville daycare. Yes, I do have a daycare already. Um, in my Pastelville town, but I decided to add a little something on this plot too So all of my kids could go to school together. So this is like a daycare um, Kindergarten situation. So let's go ahead and go inside So of course we have the place where the kiddos can sit and the teacher could sit right there read stories It's a lot of fun. And then this is the teacher's desk if they have to call a parent in for a conference, of course, they'll sit right there. The kids have lockers. They're so cute. And there's a poster on the wall. This is the restroom. There's rainbow floors. Nothing too crazy. We have some sinks. And then this is what the stalls look like. And then if we leave this room, over here we have the little cafeteria area. But the daycare can, of course, still use the cafeteria in the main school building over here this is where they can draw and write and this is like the learning area and of course we have a computer as well so that is it for the pastelville daycare i love it so much and this is not my favorite part though and i'm gonna take you guys to my favorite part of the school in a second but i did change the exterior a little bit so i added this um roof over here so we had a covered area um like if it was raining or something and the kids had to wait for their parents and i also added these rainbow tile walls and i just think it adds so much more to the building instead of just keeping it one or two colors this is the pastelville library it's the same from the original build so nothing in there changed but over here is where i added something different and i love it this is the pastelville soccer field So you guys know in the roleplay series, my son Leo plays soccer and now he can play on a soccer team at school. And the kids also have this field area to run around. They can have gym class out here. And 
there's bleachers too. I'm not sure who the first person was to do this build hack. If I can find someone who did it before me, I'll give them credits. I don't know if they're the absolute first person to do it, but trying to give credits where credits are due. I love it though, it's really cute. We have a picnic blanket and a cooler and of course two soccer goals. Let's see if I can make a goal. I did it! Go! <laughs> I mean, it was pretty easy. They're lined up to the goals, but that would have been super embarrassing if I missed. And I'm trying to get through all of this fast, but I love this walkway so much. I was considering building an entire new school campus, but I was like, why not just try and upgrade this one? There's only a few new things to show you guys, but since this school is now for all grades, Layla is of course going to be attending here, so expect a routine, but over here we have some lockers which are actually built um, from the custom blocks, and it's just so much more realistic. I used to have these decals up, and then of course the classrooms are the exact same, but over here we have locker rooms, so there's one, and then there's another. There's just a bench in the center. And then something else that was added. I don't know if you guys have seen the restrooms, but they're pretty basic. But I did add an upstairs. And up here we have a nurse's office. A lot of you guys were saying I should have added this in the original build. So I decided to do it because, I mean, it makes sense. But of course, if the kids are sick, they can come and get checked out by the nurse. They can lay here or sit over here until their parent or guardian comes and picks them up. And then the other room that I added upstairs is the music room. I absolutely love the music room so much, especially the chairs. And then we have a bookshelf over here. I hope my kids take a music class. That would be so much fun. We have a guitar at home and no one ever really plays it. So maybe the kids can learn how to play the guitar. I did change one more thing over here. We finally cleaned up from the fourth grade dance. Let me know if you remember that video. But yeah, everything is back in order. I just um, made some changes to the stage with the custom blocks. So it's more of a stair right here. And then this is where events will be announced and just stuff like that. So everyone can sit on these chairs over here. And that is it for the school updates. Um, I really, really hope we get a school update though in Bloxburg so I can have more items within the school and maybe new animations too. But I hope you guys all enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please feel free to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Once you are subscribed, click the bell button so you get notified whenever I post a video. Definitely expect some more role plays. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Just watch me play.